Hey guys, what's good? Mike here. Thanks for tuning in to another video. Happy Friday to you. In this video, I'm going to answer the question, how to get started in becoming a product designer. Okay, where do I start? Okay, Mike, you've been talking about UI, UX design. You've been talking about product design. I like the stuff that you talk about. Thank you. Thanks for all the comments that I've been getting. How do I get started, Mike? That's the most common question that I've been getting over the last three to five days. Now, I haven't touched on this because I thought I touched on this not too long ago. So I was looking through all my videos today. I'm like, man, I haven't touched on this in like almost over two years. Okay, so let's talk about it. All right. Now, just to recap, product designer, it's UI UX design. Okay, a product designer is someone that is proficient in visual, highly proficient in visual UI design, someone that is highly proficient in understanding the UX design process and methods, someone that works within a product environment that works with developers, it works with QA, product um, owners and whatnot, and produces the mockups and works with front end development to get those mockups produced into a live, into a real live product. Okay. That's what a product designer, you know, does. I talked about this in a recent video not too long ago, and that's what we do. UI, UX design. Okay. Now there's a lot of disciplines. There's a lot of things to learn in becoming pretty good in this field. You learn that over time, but in taking all those disciplines, you want to bucket all that up, push this to the side and only focus on one. You want to focus on becoming a UI designer. Okay. You want to focus on improving or just start in down the road in improving your visual UI design skills. I say focus on visual UI design. Why? Because this is the most this is the hardest discipline to perfect. It takes a lot of practice to become really good at visual aesthetics, um, designing interfaces, and you're not gonna learn this overnight. But give me somebody that is good at visual UI design and just knows aesthetics and whatnot, I can make you a great product designer in like that, right? Showing you the UX design process, the, the overall process of product development, things like that. So UI design is the one where you wanna say, take everything that I'm saying, all this garbage that I'm talking about, push that to the side and say, my number one focus from now until the next six months or whatever is just learning UI design. Okay. Now in learning UI design, there's many different things that goes on with that. Okay. You got to learn, you got to get the tool, learn how to use a tool, learn how to do design and then learn the process and whatnot. Okay. Don't try to make it complex two simple things that you can do this weekend. Okay. Now I say, learn, you're going to learn UI design. That's your path. This is how you get started. And then you can learn the, pro the UX design process after that. Okay. Um, but the first thing you do is you obtain a UI design tool. Okay. I recommend going after sketch. Now don't try to make this more complex than it is. Okay. But somebody can use Photoshop. Somebody can use Adobe XD. Somebody can use, there's some other ones out there. You, you want my advice? Go with Sketch, okay? I talked about PC or Mac already in a recent video. Just go and get you a Mac, get you Sketch, okay? You will be in a position down a path where all tech companies and a majority of UX designers, UI product designers are using, okay? Macs and using, they're using Sketch, okay, with Envision. You want to go and obtain a copy of Sketch. Now what you do over the weekend is you go on YouTube, and you start fiddling around looking at different uh, sketch tutorials, okay? How to just get familiar with the, the, um, the interface, okay? How to create a circle, how to create a shape, how to add colors and whatnot, okay? If you want a more deeper uh, looking over my shoulder, you can go to my site right now, mlwebco.com, and click on the training link. I have some material there. Now, I am... You can, you can learn Sketch, you can learn Photoshop and whatnot. This is, but you can also, you get access to all my old material. Okay. This is, I make this available to folks right now as I'm working on creating a new product design course, um, because the stuff that I have on my website is invaluable. Okay. It's going to teach you everything you learned, even though a lot of my old material is done in Adobe Fireworks, the principles that I use is invaluable. So if you're wanting to understand how I think, how I go through designing mock-ups and personal projects and whatnot, you can do that right now on my website. Now, what you do 
if that's your that's up to you if you want to go to my site and get access to that you can do so right away um, but if you don't want to do that you can also just obtain a copy of sketch and then what you want to do is just get familiar with the interface now here's how you take it a little step further you want to go out there and start copying every single site that you can get your hand on that you like any every little in interface now I teach copying right a lot of people don't like that because I don't know what everybody does it but I seem to be the only one that teaches this this is how you become great at visual UI design okay you will go out there go out to dribble take a copy take a take a screenshot and you just start copying every little nook and cranny down to the the drop shadows the font types the colors and whatnot and you do this for practice over and over and over and over again and what this is going to do is familiarize yourself with some of the tools like how to do you know the button size and the dimensions and things like that okay um, there's a lot of steps in this but this is just you know just to kind of get you thinking and kind of get you started in a nutshell in my opinion if you did that over the next six you know three months or whatnot you will start to become familiar with just interface now at this point you don't really know exactly the process the UI design process that takes a little bit more involved again you can learn my process right now on my website at mlfco.com click on the training link now some of this material is older material but if you're if you're able to use a tool like sketch and just follow along in what I've done in like in the past and like Adobe fireworks I show you some of the, the the principles that I use today now what I recommend you do get started today okay do what I just did do I say get sketch and just over the weekend just go on YouTube and just start fiddling around with it that's how I, I would get started okay as you grow as days go by as weeks go by you're gonna get familiar with and want a little bit more that's where you come back into and now you're ready for the next phase and like learning the UI design process learning um, you know how you go from a blank slate taking requirements and whatnot and then going out there and using other competitors as resources and whatnot and filling into a project that comes in time like I said I'm currently working on new material um, involving sketch involving my new UI design process that will be um, going over um, uh, the process and designing for mobile for desktop along with new improved UX design uh, training material in terms of the methods and process that I use you don't want to get all bugged down into all the whole scope of things right now over the weekend get started today get a copy of sketch get a UI design tool and start fiddling around with down the path of, of becoming very good at visual UI design if you want to know how you get started that's how you get started now there's a lot of stuff that's involved down the road I recommend do, taking my advice continue to watch my videos I'm gonna lead you down that path and going from learning nothing knowing nothing to landing a job getting your foot in the door where you're gonna start growing and you know building your career shout out to so many people hitting me up already who have taken taken my course and, and have viewed my older material that have gone on to bigger and better things just got a DM from somebody on Twitter saying Mike thank you so much I have your older material I've done your course like I think a year ago whatever but he's gone on and now he's working for Disney and now he started his own YouTube channel and he's got like over 7,000 subscribers already man that's what it's all about anyway that's what I'm talking about the the best advice that someone has given me don't be looking at competitors don't be looking at anyone else put on your blinders and take action upon what I'm saying okay if you don't look at anything else don't watch TV don't worry about your friends going out this weekend okay get your head down if you're not where you want to be if you're at a job right now you're not at you know where you want to be maybe you are a designer maybe you're not a designer doesn't matter you want to get that job you need to be working on that new project a new personal project that new and improved personal project to put to your portfolio if you don't have any skills you want to start learning UI design first and foremost and you can do that this weekend anyway thanks for watching guys if you like the things that I talk about hit the thumbs up button and as always 
visit my website mlwebco.com and use the contact link on my site to answer, uh, ask me any questions. I'll be happy to answer your questions for you. We'll talk soon, guys. Until next video, peace.